Witam wszystkich widzów bardzo serdecznie w 12, nie, 13 odcinku z serii z gry The Walking Dead. W poprzednim odcinku właśnie sobie spadliśmy stamtąd i jesteśmy w kanałach. Musimy dotrzeć do swojej grupy z powrotem. Także let's go. Ja oczywiście wiem, jak to przejść, przez to, że y, te poprzednie y, raz, jak nagrywałam cały epizod, to niestety, niestety mi y, się nie nagrał dźwięk z gry, to teraz już wiem, jak to przejść. Chociaż nie jest to trudne, ale troszkę główkowałam. Także idźmy. I teraz tak... Y, tu są trupy. Jak widać. Ale przyspieszył kroku. I teraz... Yy, musimy... Tutaj wejść. Słuchajcie. Yy, pokręcić tym. Tak, musimy to y, zakręcić z powrotem, tak było. Wyciągnąć. Przejść tędy. Otworzyć to sobie. żeby mieć przejście tutaj. I teraz słuchajcie. Tutaj to wsadzić. Pokręcić tym. I spierdzielić do y, tamtego korytarza, który przed chwilą sobie otworzyliśmy. Tutaj, tutaj, do tego i do tego tu wejść. Tak, żebyśmy już byli bezpieczni. No i teraz musimy poczekać, aż oni wszyscy sobie przejdą na tamtą stronę, do tej wody. Chyba wszyscy. Owszem, wszyscy. Przy okazji wiemy, co się stało z Czakiem. Idziemy dalej. Eee. Nie pistoletem, tym. I teraz tym. Nie tym, tym. No właśnie. 
żeby nie robić hałasu. E, dobra. I teraz musimy tu sobie wejść. Albo i nie. Wchodzimy. Idziemy. It's all right. It's okay. I don't want any trouble. Neither do we. Which is why you do well to turn around and leave right now. Look, I'm sorry I disturbed you folks. I'll just be going. You can't let him leave. He's from Crawford. If he goes back there and they find out we're down here. Are you from Crawford? They don't lie to me. I know. Where else can he be from? Everywhere else around here is dead. I think you better start talking. I'm not from around here. I'm from Athens. Grew up in Macon. I have a brother in Macon. You were there. I wasn't. As bad as here. I'm sorry. You can't trust him, Vernon. You can't let him leave. What do you want me to do? Shoot him in the head? Why not? Be more of a mercy than anyone from Crawford ever showed us. Think, Vernon. What do you think they'll do if they find out we're down here, right under their feet? Damn it. You're right. I'm sorry, friend. Can't take the risk. I'm not from Crawford, but I saw what they did up there. It made me sick. I'm not like them, and I don't think you are either. I think you're a good man. Keep back, or I swear I'll shoot. It's all right. It's okay. Vernon, what the hell are you doing? Vernon! Relax. I'm not here to hurt you. <laughs> You're really not from Crawford? Yeah. No, I'm really not. Well, we are, or were. We got out of there when they started sealing up the place. You know, started weeding out the sick and the old so that perfect survivor society wouldn't be threatened. No room for weakness or vulnerability in their little master race. You don't look that old, so you're sick? We're sick. We're all members of a cancer survivors group that used to meet here at the hospital. We're in remission. But that wasn't good enough for Crawford. They'd already rounded up five of us before the rest of us managed to hole up and hide from them down here. This old basement's been abandoned for years. What is this? The morgue? Yeah. Irony's always high on my list when I'm looking for a place to survive. How did you find your way down here? My group and I were up by the river looking for a boat. Now I just want to get out of here and find them again. Well, that sewer system you came through runs all over the city. It'll take you wherever you want to go. Those sewers are like a damn maze. Any chance you could help me find my way back? Look, I'd like to help you, but we've all got our own problems. Two of our group are sick and need constant care, and I'm the only doctor here. Besides, why should we help you? <sighs> Look, sorry if I scared you. I just want to get back to my people. Back to Clementine. She's your daughter? Yeah. No. She lost her real parents. I'm doing what I can. You're not seriously considering going with him. It's all right, Bree. I had a daughter, too. Lost her in the first days. I'll be damned if I'll just sit back and let that happen to someone else. We need you here. Don't worry. I'll be back before you know it. Let's go. Widzicie, Karli miała rację. 
w drugim epizodzie, że warto być szczerym z ludźmi, bo wtedy ci pomagają. A przy okazji zdobędziemy lekarza. Clementine? Clem? Molly? Oh, hey, you made it back. Who's this? He didn't tell you about me? Understandable. I'm the one who put that beating on him when he tried to jump me back at the river. Who's the fossil? Where's Clementine? She's around here somewhere. Relax. I got her and Kenny both back safely. You're welcome, by the way. I think you have something that belongs to me. Lee, thank God you're back. Krista, what's wrong? It's on me. He's gotten worse. Much worse. We have a man wounded. Who's this? This is Vernon. He's a doctor. Oh, thank God. Could you take a look at him? You have to help us. Please. I'll see what I can do. Take me to him. All right. Lee brought a doctor. All right, let's take a look at him. I work better without an audience. I'm sure you have more things of your own to attend to. No i dobrze, bo przynajmniej go wyleczy. Tak, a my szukamy Klementyna. Ale dobra, ja wiem, gdzie ona jest. Ona jest na dole. I na dworze. Kenny? Oh, hey, you made it back. Good job. Good job. What the hell do you think you're doing? What does it look like? Where'd you get the bottle? Found it. <laughs> First good thing that's happened since. Take it easy. I think you've had enough. To hell with you! Getting wasted's not gonna help anyone. Yeah? Well, what is? We are fucked! Molly said there's not a single boat left in Savannah. No way out. We got walkers all around us, that crazy fuck on the radio messing with us. Hell, if now ain't the time for a drink? Clementine, you hear? Clementine? Clementine! Ja wiem, gdzie ona jest, także spokojnie. Się nie stresujmy. No.
<laughs> Sua diara. That's a swear. <laughs> Pamiętam. No, łódka się znalazła, już problemu nie ma. Niepotrzebnie dramatyzowaliście. I to jeszcze jaka? <laughs> You're making everyone nervous. Why are you even still here? Hey, if your friend really can get that boat working, you're taking me with you as payment for saving your asses. I figure that's fair enough, don't you? Well? You want the good news or the bad news? Uh, zwa. Let's get the bad news out of the way first. Bad news is, she's not taking us anywhere the shape she's in right now. Gas tank's empty and the battery's dead. So what's the good news? That's it. That's all she needs. Some gas and a battery. Other than that, she's good to go. Well, how are we supposed to get that stuff? Hmm. Sounds like Crawford is the one place that has everything we need. Maybe we should try there. Now hold on a minute. Surely we have to try? If there are people left in this city who are still alive, who still have supplies, what harm can it do to ask? Trust me, you don't know these people. I do. You showing up with a wounded man, might as well put a noose around his neck. They don't exactly welcome children with open arms either. What the hell kind of a place are we talking about here? The worst kind? But I don't see what other choice we have. And just how exactly do you figure we do this? Because from what I've heard, that place ain't exactly friendly to outsiders. There's got to be some way we can sneak in there undetected. There might actually be a way. I know the sewer system that runs beneath Crawford like the back of my hand. Y'all wouldn't happen to have a map by any chance. Mama. Yeah, actually. I think I could lead us through so we could pass under the perimeter and right into the center where they keep their supplies. We come up right underneath them, take them by surprise, grab what we need, and get out before they even knew what hit them. That's... Actually, not the worst idea I've ever heard. I mean, it's close, but I don't know. Maybe it could work. I've thought about it before, just never had the people to do it. But I think if we all work together, we could pull it off. And what do you want in return for all this help you're giving us? Crawford doesn't just have what you need for your boat. They're also well stocked with medical supplies. Medicine that my people could use, just as oh. yours could. We can do this. We have to. So? It's decided then. We're going to Crawford. Oh yeah. I don't know about you, kid, but I'd rather take a chance on doing something. Zapomniałam. Here waiting to die. That boat out there. Sorry, zapatrzyłam się. Just gotta push a little bit farther. Are you in or out? We should go tonight, under cover of dark. I'll go let my people know. Give you all a chance to prepare. I'll be back before midnight. Be careful. That's how I'm still alive. I told you to stay in your room. How long have you been there? Is it going to be dangerous? Is what going to be dangerous? Crawford. Mm. I can't 
Tak jej powiedziałam wtedy. Zgodziłam się wtedy, więc teraz też się zgadzam. what I found in the garage. Hatchet, hacksaw, some other tools. Might come in handy on this little break-in. Nice. Can I talk to you a minute? What's up? I took another look at the boat. She's a 30-footer. So? So we're gonna have a capacity problem. A boat that size ain't gonna hold more than five people, even with one of them a kid. Me, you, Claire, Krista, Oni, Ben, Father. Assuming everyone makes it back alive, still one too many even if we cut molly loose before this is over then i have to make a decision you're not serious look i'm just saying if we want the best chance of who the hell is this this is free she can help us uh. Good. we're gonna need all the help we can get I was a student at the school where Crawford keeps their supplies. I know the layout. Then what are we waiting for? Let's get moving. Hold up just a sec. Are you ready? Ready. Hey, whoa, hold on a minute. You're not taking her with us. Did you not hear anything I said about the kind of place Crawford is? If you take her in there and they find her... This little girl's not just excess baggage. She's gotten us out of a tight spot more than once. She's coming. Deal with it. You heard the man. Let's move out. No to lecimy. Będziemy obrabiać. Kurde. Okay, people. This is it. Remember the plan. We stay quiet. We stay hidden, and we stay together. We find what we need, and we get the hell out before anyone even knows we're there. Got it? And that part about staying close that goes double for you. Słodkie. Dobra. Otwieramy. No, wychodź. Let's go. Where is everybody? There should be guards patrolling. What? You disappointed? 
It's just strange, is all. I think I see one over there by the door. Okay. We'll get Kitty and sneak out, try to take him out quiet. The rest of you wait for our signal, then follow us over. Everybody got it? Okay, Kitty, let's do this quiet. No shooting unless there's no other choice. Right behind you. Jak widać, Crawford nie przeszło próby czasu, że tak powiem. No pewnie to. Definitely. What the hell happened here? I thought this place was supposed to be secure. What always happens, I guess. In the end, the dead always win. Oh man, we are so screwed. No, this is good. Vernon's <sighs> right. We can deal with walkers easier than armed guards. I agree. So long as we don't let them box us in, we can still do this. The plan hasn't changed. The plan hasn't changed? Every time walkers show up, the plan changes. Do you even have any idea how many of them are out there? No. You want to do a head count? Or do you want to get what we need and get the hell out of here? Come on. I think I know which way to head. I got a bad feeling about this. Just keep moving. Okay. Everybody in. like they were using this room as some kind of command center. Okay, so now what? Where do we start looking? Here. Just give me a sec. place to look for medicine right here nurses station they were using it as a medical facility how do you know that <laughs> no ciekawe makes sense doesn't it where can we find some fuel for the boat there's a maintenance shed across from the playground here if they were storing fuel that's probably where it'll be 
So then we just need a battery. This auto shop. It's right next door. Yep, it's called Herman's. You can't miss it. Okay, I'll make the run to the maintenance shed for the fuel. It'll be faster if I go with you. I can take you right to it. I'll come too. No, two people's enough. You stay here, see if you can use any of those tools we brought to get that armory door open. We might need to shoot our way out of here. I'll go for the medicine. I'll come with you. I know what to take. Okay. Guess that leaves me to go find us a battery. I'll go with you. Watch your back. Okay, we've got a plan. Everyone be careful. Stay close to one another. We'll all meet back here. Good luck. What about me? What can I do? I need you to stay here with Finn and watch over our command center. I'm putting you in charge of it, okay? <laughs> oh, yeah, you. You're leaving me with Ben? <laughs> I'm leaving you with Ben. I'm leaving him with you. Understand? Oh, okay. Swat Geist. Back before you know. You will be my mom. I nie tylko w tym sezonie, ale każdy inny, który później będę nagrywać, to ona jest mega. Najlepsza postać. Dobra. To słuchajcie, jak już zakończyliśmy yy, w Crawford, to mam pół godziny nagrania tego odcinka, więc tak sobie myślę, że możemy zakończyć w tym miejscu. Yy, I następny odcinek yy, po prostu będzie już z plądrowania tego miejsca. Także mam nadzieję, że Wam się podobało. W prawym górnym rogu adnotacja do e, całej serii na kanale. E, za tydzień się widzimy z The Walking Dead i do zobaczenia.